It's all time, welcome back to Final Fantasy VII Remake. Oh, it's this guy. I met him earlier. Philosophical quandary torment me. You totally get where I'm coming from, right? I agree with Tony. Yeah, no, um, not really. Yeah, I should have figured. You're not the philosophical, introspective type like me. That soft, naive face. I know you're kind, well, bro. You're just another muscle head who uses violence to work through your inner demons. It's sad, really. Huh? Yeah, what's up? Seen Tifa around? Tifa, my love, my light? Who are you and how do you know her? No, shut up. I don't care. Tifa's here? Why? Tell me why! Oh god, no. I did this to her, didn't I? She came looking for me to beg me not to leave her. <gasps> Snap out of it, Johnny. Your Tifa needs you. Tifa, I'm coming, baby! Who was that? Nobody you want or need to know. And actually, I'm gonna visit some NPC here. Uh, I can't believe I bought the same disc twice. Uh, excuse me, sir. If you like, you can have it. You do. Yes, you. Do you have a place to stay this enchanted evening? We have the perfect room for a sweet-looking couple like you. Man, yeah, no thanks. How much? I go. Man, yeah, we could rest here. How much? <laughs> Just give me a holler when you change your mind. Welcome. Are you in need of accommodations? Have a safe cool. trip. We can restore Hopi and MP here. And at this place, weapon shop, we can actually buy a new weapon, hard dead. So. Check it out. Uh... I think we might have found our man, and he's a gaudy one. Yeah. Not so fast, buddy. Back it up. Got no need for pretty boys here. We're looking for someone. Let me guess. First time in Walmart, kid. Yeah? So? So people can't just walk through the Don's front door. Especially men. How about me, then? Can I go inside? Maybe. But you're gonna wish you didn't. You know Leslie? She's kinda cute! Homely, but cute. Excuse you? Kinda cute's not gonna cut it. Come on, can't you help us out? Do you have any idea what you're getting yourself into? Aerith. Seriously, Les, she's not half bad. With a little work, I bet she'd clean up real nice. Cloud, requesting permission to kill. Denied. <sighs> if you're really sure you want to join an audition, then you're going to need to get official approval. And who can give us that? The trio. The only ones in town who are considered authorities on Corneo's particular tastes. First, there's Chocobo San. And then there's Madame M over at the massage parlor. Last but not least, there's the Honeybee Inn's Andrea Rodea. They're an eccentric bunch, to put it mildly. And you should know they don't recommend just any girl stupid enough to come knocking. Hmm. Duly noted. Thanks for the info. We'll be back soon. Aerith, you sure about this? If you've got any better ideas... Not really. So that's the way it is. Mm. Tifa's been invited into the oh Don's no. estate. This guy's huh? here again. But, to earn such a privilege, you must first win the approval of one of the trio. Right? Meaning, I now know what I must do to save her. Stay strong, Tifa! Help is on the way! Johnny's coming, baby! <laughs> 
not the sharpest tool in the shed, is he? Nope. Nope. Not you two again. Told you once, I'll tell you a thousand times. Got nothing for you. Now scram. Wait, here's out. You're one of the trio, right? I want you to get me into the audition. Huh? Pretty please? Why not? Really? Sure. Next time an audition comes around, I'll put your name in the hat. Next time will be too late. Can't you get me into this one? You want in now? No can do, sweetheart. Hardy recommended Tifa. She's got this in the bag. How can you be so sure Corneo will pick Tifa? You never know, he might pick me. Damn, you really do want in, don't you? Sure do. Then how's about we play for it? Call it, Missy. Heads or tails? Yes, right. And I'll grant you your wish. <sighs> yes, wrong. And you'll leave me in peace. Man, that's interesting. Tails. Ed, you lose. No. <sighs> hey, don't look so glum. You're a pretty enough gown. Just not quite Corneo's cup of tea. But if only the Don will do, try convincing one of the other two. That's why it's a trio, and not just the Mio. Now skedaddle. Wait. Mind if I see that coin of yours? Market way. Lesson learned. Still cheating. Damn, Wait, man. Is this the place? Why is it supposed to go down like this? I think so. Uh, I just wanted to Let see me handle Andrea. this. Curse you wait out here, will. okay? Then why would I do that? Like... No, I'm coming with. I'm not really sure that... You're a man of many talents, but talking isn't one of them. Welcome to the heart and soul of Wall Market, the Honey Bee Inn. Is there a honey boy or girl whose company you desire? Uh, we're here to see Andrea Rodea. Ah, the shining star of the Honey Bee Inn. Now, are you the one who made the appointment, sir? Can I have your name? Oh, we don't have an appointment. I see. I'm terribly sorry, sir. An appointment is required. And the earliest available slot is three years from now. Three years?! All we want is five minutes. He can spare that. I need his help for the Corneo audition. Yes, well, regardless of the circumstances, you cannot meet him without an appointment. Is there really no other way? It is rare, but Mr. Rodea does occasionally extend invitations to individuals who catch his eye. Otherwise, I'm sorry. But there really is nothing that can be done. I guess that's that then. Oh well, let's try someone else. Hello. Welcome, welcome. Just the two of you? Step right up. Now then, 
What manner of massage do you desire? Say what? Is this your first time in our establishment? Mm -hmm. We are a hand massage parlor. An excess of fatigue and tension can make even the simplest task a terrible strain. It is our pleasure to relieve our patrons of that tension. <laughs> And what better way to seek relief than through the skilled ministrations of a professional? So now that we understand each other, what manner of massage do you desire? We're not customers. Then you are... Hoping you can help us get an invite to an audition with oh, Don... Oh, love of... Say another word and I'll shove this fan right down your throat. Oh. Uh. Ugh, this is the last thing I need. You're young and stupid, and I suppose that means you think I'll let you off easy. So, you want what? A favor? Well, here's the thing. This is a massage parlor, a respectable establishment. But if you don't require our services... Then tell me! Is there any reason I shouldn't have you dragged outside and shot for wasting my valuable time? Well... Hmm... Name? Cloud Strife. Hand. Huh? Give it to me! Oh. The strong, firm hands of a fighter. Yet they possess a certain elegance and grace. Okay, Cloud. Let's see what you're made of. After that, we'll talk. So, which course will it be? Luxury course, standard course, all men's course. Well, we can only go for this. <laughs> oh, the other one. Then make your way to the room in the back. And wait. Cloud? Well then, it should go without saying that you get what you pay for. All four fingers at once, quick, and to the point. Uh, uh, little rough. Hmm? They can stop at any time if it's too much to handle. <laughs> that was an interesting hand massage. Try flexing the muscles. You'll feel the difference. Hmm? Loose and limber. Am I right? Actually, yeah. Hmm. How was it? It's all right, I guess. What are you doing? Flexing. Flexing. Uh, never mind. Hm. Think you'll make a habit of it? <sighs> All right then. I think I've seen everything I need to see. So, tell me what you want, and we'll take it from there. You're one of the trio, right? I want to get into Corneo's next audition. And why in the world would you want to do that? Hmm? Okay. Really? But, you cannot go dress like that. Huh? I could never send Corneo a candidate wearing such a plain-looking getup. Doing so would call my position as one of the trio into question. Is something wrong with my outfit? It's alright. It matter what I think. It matter what I think? Well, I think it's pretty cool. Look, just take it outside the parlor, would you? Sorry, we'll stop. So... What should I do about the outfit? <laughs> you just leave that to me. I'll put you in a dress so fabulous, you'll look like a million gill. 
so long as you can afford it. How much? What I said. But don't worry. It's obvious you can't afford a dress with that kind of price tag. So listen, I have an idea. Uh. There's an underground coliseum in this town. Up for a fight, Cloud? Good. Because I'm getting you into that arena. If you win the tournament, I'll transform Aerith into a drop-dead gorgeous beauty. Is there any prize money? <laughs> yes, for the person who got you in. So, what do you say? All right. That's what I like to hear. You'll need this. They're already letting fighters inside. You should hurry. Run along. What's this? You're here to compete? <laughs> I hope you know you're cutting it really close. So, the two of you are a team? Team? No, it's just me. Yes, the two of us are a team. I need to get into that audition, but I won't let anyone else fight my battles for me. That includes you, mister. <sighs> Alright, team it is. Head to the waiting area down below. You lost? This is for spectators only. Yeah, we down, go. down, down we go. So, how deep does this thing go, you think? I wonder how many people are fighting. Hey, you're not nervous, are you? Nope. Really? You're even more quiet than usual. Just trying to focus. Like you should. Hey! Lovebirds! Over here! You two, wait here until it's time. All right, um, rest place here. Always good to go some items. Oh, <laughs> you again? Ouch! What happened to your face? I just needed a little scratch, you know. So I signed up for the preliminaries, and well, I hope you guys realize what you're getting into. I don't want to scare you, but if you can make a run for it, you should. Cloud and Aerith, your match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. 
They're in way too deep to back out now. Let's go. You two ready? Oh, Try not to get yourselves killed. For our next batch, we welcome two fighters, a young couple no less. Talk about a bad day! This is their first tournament, the bad first date, and most likely their last, inexperienced as they are. Or are they? Give it up for Cloud and Eric! Woo! One of Wall Market's own, a renowned master of beasts. Will his threats make a meal of our two challenges before our very eyes? They've already been given their appetizers. Their hunger for flesh and fear is unquenchable. The demon talks of hell. The Penguin Stalker! Well, that's one win down. Go team! Hmm. What's wrong? The rules don't make sense. Yeah, true. But maybe it'll be better in the next match? Nah. Wouldn't bet on it. Better to expect the worst. Oh. Alright, we rest and go to the next one. Cloud and Aerith, your match will begin shortly. Please make your way to the gate. That's what they call beginner's luck. But the next match won't be so easy. Ready to rock? Just remember, try not to die. For the second match in our spectacular semi-final! Fresh from their first day with death, I present the Lucky Couple! We're like unlucky for the rest of us! Give it up once again for Cloud and Eric! Couple my ass! What the hell would you try to pull? You assholes cost me a fortune! Yeah, yeah! Their opponents, screamers in this trap, thieves and killers through and through! 
criminal for common criminals. The worst of the worst. Ladies and gentlemen, check your pockets because they may have already robbed you blind. The most contemptible sons of bitches inside of Walmart market. Max Benefit. Man, this should be. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna do it. Maybe I need too far. Never mind. Oh, well, the blood record will already. I don't know if I'll do it Again, we can break them. That kid's really something. Well, of course he is. I did give him a massage, you know. His palm told quite the tale. He's cheated death more than a few times. Hmm. So have half the people in this town. Anyway, we're both still alive. <sighs> there you go again. One of these days, your luck is going to run out. 
when I fall from grace. Maybe I'll land in your parlor once more. <clears throat> that is one mistake I will never repeat. <laughs> you gotta admit, Andy, the way he moves is totally amazing. Andy! Next up, the big finale. Yeah. I thought you'd be happier. Just thinking about what we might face next. But you know, we've made it this far. I'm sure we can handle anything they throw at us. Man. Sure again. And Aaron. All right, the yeah, ready to rumble. Shortly. Please make your way to the gate. Man, you proved me wrong. You guys are pretty good. It's the final match. You good to go? Always. I've got a lot of money riding on you two. Win it for me. Ladies and gentlemen, our time together is almost over. Tonight's thrilling tornado cup, filled with unprecedented upsets and drama, has only one match to go! <laughs> we know, we're just as disappointed as you are. But ladies and gentlemen, all good things must come to an end. So let's celebrate by getting so damn loud, they'll hear us up on the play! Yeah! Come on! Once more, the sweethearts who surprised us with upset after spectacular upset. The power couple with the boundless love for bloodshed. The champions of Madame M, Cloud, and Eric! Silence.
and the winners of the Corneo Cup, the deadly and dynamic duo, Cologne and Aaron! My condolences. Oh, you're taking this rather well. I was looking forward to a little temper tantrum. You bet it all on a toss. Sometimes you get burned by Lady Luck. Every coin has two sides. You're right, of course. Even if they are both the same. <laughs> Later. And now, I believe I have a prize to collect. Sorry. The madam will have to wait. The Don's demanding that we tack on one more match, it seems. What? If they win out, then you get paid in full. Now hold on just a goddamn minute. His call, not mine. <laughs> now that that's over, we can go save Tifa. So we'll head back to Madame M's, get you changed, and then it's off to Corneo's. Right. Sorry to be the bearer of bad news, but you still have one fight left. What do you mean? The crowd loved your show a little too much. People were placing hefty bets. Much heftier than you can possibly imagine. Corneo's going to milk this for as much as he can. Meaning what? You face and defeat Corneo's fighter of choice. And only then will you be declared winners of the tournament. Hey, that wasn't the deal! Don't you think I know that?! You greedy bastard, scum-sucking piece of shit festering asshole! Oh, wow. uh, <sighs> but that's the way it is. Corneo's the one who makes the rules around here. But if you win this match, Corneo will have to accept your victory. And the crowd will make sure he does. So this is the last one? <laughs> I sure hope so. Alright, we rest, and then we go. Watching you guys fight gave me goosebumps! Hope your next match is even better than the last! Ready to kick ass? It's not even about the money anymore, man. I just want you guys to win it all. Show them what you got. Tonight's Corneo Cup has been a spectacle like no other. And we shared your disappointment, ladies and gentlemen, when we told you that it was coming to an end. But nobody felt it more keenly than one time Corneo, who has decided that a bonus match is in order! <laughs> Participating in this match will be this evening's leading lights, the dynamic duo that has crushed all competitions thus far! Klaus and Eric! Interesting. His house is for uh, normal enemies at the uh, original. He is a uh, boss fighter. That's pretty cool. That's no ordinary house. The 
manifestation of pure evil versus the most badass couple this side of Midgar. Have you ever seen a fight more incredible, more epic? You have not. No, sir, you have not. They'll be singing songs about tonight for generations to come. Keep your eyes glued to the action, ladies and gentlemen. The Cups fight final battle begins now. Oh, the battle is joined. And already I can tell you this bonus match will not be that is. Let's go. Interesting. You can change the elements. Next slide, pick to ice. Test of the top, the meanest of the mean. <laughs> can they handle the horror of the hellhound? <laughs> Who is the battle pilot? Drag yourself in, folks, because this show is only getting started. Shatter. <laughs> oh, that has hurt. As I'm standing here, all the about this house's major design wall. <laughs> The natural item was in a bean. I'm coming! Look out, folks! Cloud and Aaron are going for the jugular! That was close. It looks like the hell out! It's going to the neighborhood! Get together! Whoa! Our lucky couple's been invited to the story! No, not yet. Take it off. Kill. 
Showing an interest in someone. What will you do? <laughs> and I'm done with this video. Thanks for watching. Remember to sub proper like the video if you enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys next time.